this question, there's an original graph on the top, a transform graph on the bottom, and then we are supposed to pick out the values that are already on the screen. Let's pretend they're not. We're supposed to pick out the values A and B. How are we gonna do that? Well, before we think about how, let's think about what these mean. A is the vertical stretch. Now I know it's a stretch because it's a multiplication instead of an addition or subtraction. I know it's vertical because it happens outside the function. Now for B, what is B doing? It's multiplying, so it's another stretch, but it's multiplying directly X, so it's a stretch horizontal. All right, there's no shift here, just stretching. Okay, let's look at the original and then the graph on the bottom. We can see everything here. And now we could start looking at some points. Three obvious points turn into three other points right there. All right, this one doesn't move because its Y coordinate is zero. So on the stretch, it's not gonna move at all. Uh, the other one's Y coordinates are not zero, so they do move. So this one that was at po uh, negative two goes to positive six. So this went from, these are Y's, so they're vertical, from negative two to positive six. How do we do that? In a stretch, How we gotta multiply negative two times negative three is six. So here we're gonna multiply by negative three. Probably should have drawn this arrow vertically. Um, so our Y stretch is by negative three. Let's check it with the last point. So last point had a Y coordinate of two. And what would that negative three stretch turn it into? Negative six, and we see down here, the Y coordinate is negative six. All right, verticals are as they appear. So this one is A is negative three. All right, let's think about the right here horizontal. So we're gonna think about X coordinates now. Do the X coordinates change? The X coordinates were negative, uh, positive one, two, three, and they become positive one, two, three. So the X coordinates didn't change at all. They didn't shift, they didn't stretch. So that means A had no effect. If, that means B had no effect. B is the horizontal. What does it mean to have no effect? Well, if we look, what do you multiply X by to have no effect? You multiply X by one. So if B is one, that's how a stretch has no effect. Uh, be careful, a stretch of zero means everything becomes zero and that would never, you would never get a stretch of zero. Uh, so no stretch means a stretch of one and we should see negative three and positive one. There we go. You make it a negative uh, one and what negative one would do, it would re reverse these from positive one, two and three to negative one, two and three. So that could somewhat keep, it'll keep the width of the graph but the X coordinates would likely change.